the rest, not least for Mike, he'd made it too. <laughs> Kenneth Moore was one of the stars at the Kinematograph Rental Society dinner. Gary Cooper and Max Bygraves were two more of the distinguished guests at Pinewood, where Ruben Mamoulian is directing Cleopatra. Mr. Spiros Skouras was present, of course, at the dinner given for the Royal Naval Film Corporation, of which the Earl Mountbatten of Burma is president. A film set for the reception. Lord Mountbatten and Walter Wanger, producer of Cleopatra. The guest of the evening was His Royal Highness Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh, who's patron of the Royal Naval Film Corporation. Bow from his uncle, and from a pretty young beef-eater, the offer of a drink. His Royal Highness has a chat with Mr. Skouris. Presently, the whole company moves to a spectacular Cleopatra set for the dinner. A scene of magnificence, and a sparkling speech from the Prince. My lords and gentlemen, thank you very much indeed for your kind welcome and for the very nice things you said about me and also for this excellent dinner. I can tell you that I'm prepared to grace almost anything for a meal like that. <laughs> now, you've probably gathered, I hope by now, if you've been paying attention, <laughs> that the um, cinema industry very generously allow the Royal Navy to have films that literally give away terms. I'd only like to add this, that it is only this fact that makes it possible for films, for ships to have films at all. I realize, of course, that their lordships, having served under them for a brief period, <laughs> uh, <clears throat> have the welfare of the officers and men of the Royal Navy at heart all the time. But, of course, it doesn't go quite so far as to hire entertainment at commercial rates. <laughs> I know from personal experience the value of the work which the Film Corporation does. I can tell you, I took full advantage of the, uh, of the corporation uh, during my spell in the Navy, but little did I know the price that I would have to pay for it in the end. <laughs> this is the only dinner that I have ever attended 